Damon Bruce here, and welcome to the NBA on 2K Sports. Thursday hoops. It'll be LeBron James and the Miami Heat facing off against Jason Kidd and the Dallas Mavericks. And now it's time to get out to the action with Kevin Harlan and our 2K Sports crew. We'll be back later with the HP Halftime Report. Tyson Chandler, the big man in the middle. They look to him to provide that necessary presence down low. And it's Karan Butler. And it's Davitsky in at the four-man position. Takes it up. And it's Butler missing. Tough season left. setback. I mean, Karan is one of the toughest players in the league and has been since he stepped foot in the NBA. If anybody can come back from that, I think he can. All right, now we're going to go to Doris Burke, who spoke with head coach Eric Spolster. What would you find out, Doris? Yes, guys. He said, I think this game will prove what a sharp team we are defensively. You're going to see us communicating, helping, and anticipating where the ball's going and where we need to be. Their defense is on a Great stuff, Doris. Thanks. That's a mantra, Clark. We're going to hear, I think, a lot from coaches. Defense first. Yeah, you hear it all the time, Kevin. And that's the identity they want to have today. And I think it'll work for them as long as they execute it. Yeah, exactly. I mean, it's one thing to say it, but you've got to bring it. I think this team has to show great energy and aggression early on if they're going to win this game. You know, the Mavericks did a really good job against the East, and you have to be strong out of conference. Three seed in the West. And Miami has possession. LeBron is to Anthony. Wade gets to Jones. Bosch. Let's go. About three and a half minutes left to play in the first. And here's Kidd from the arc. It's hauled in by the Heat. You're right about the Mavs there, Clark. 22 and 8 against the East last year. Steve, some good numbers. Not surprising. tough position last season. Never before had there been a bigger free agent talent swing. And he was tasked with getting three huge superstars to mesh as a unit. He's done a nice job. And it's Miami's ball. It's a three-point game. Well, he knows his role. He embraces it. And he's really a guy
some very unique situations pop up along that road. Well, he sure did, Kevin. And, and he had to coach that team under a microscope all season long. The basketball world was watching when that Miami team went through some ups and downs. But in the end, I think Eric Spolster did a fantastic job. And he looks to be one of the bright young coaches in this league. Kid kicks the butt from deep. Kid, no good. Wade for three. No luck. How the Mavericks take it the other way. There's 57 seconds left to play here in the first. That's good. Kid's got himself going there. His first points of the game on the deep ball. With the fadeaway. And there's Dwayne Wade on the assist by LeBron. Uh, he's a pleasure to watch on the offense. That's his first foul. A different look for Dallas. Haywood comes in for Chandler. And it's Terry in for Rudy Fernandez. Giannis Haslam checked in for the Heat. House comes in for Mario Chalmers. Haywood back it down. Shot clock at six. Play here. Sprite Slam Cam showing it once more. There are 21 seconds left to play in the first quarter. It's stolen by Wade. Great job playing the passing lanes and forcing that turnover. Three seconds left. LeBron James again. His third basket of the night right there. And a high scoring first quarter. Both teams. Well, the West has long been considered the stronger of the two conferences in the NBA, but Miami, with its revamped roster, really had uh, no problem beating Western Conference foes last year. Releases from 15, and another basket for Miami. Average trail by three. served as motivation for him after he got over the hurt and the pain of it. I mean, his mental makeup was a lot less jovial and more, um, more focused and more serious. And part of that is growing up, but I think part of it was the um, byproducts of what he had gone through. by one. That's for 
accept what you say.